So what an opportunity this is for the explosive, unbeaten power puncher from Maidstone, Sam Noakes, fighting for the European lightweight title in his 14th fight, and it's against a man he once, once paid to watch, 38-year-old Ivan Mendy, who had Noakes in the crowd the night he fought Luke Campbell for the second time in 2018. It's a significant fight, a significant belt, and a massive night for Sam Noakes, Richie. Yes, it is indeed. This, is, this will be his toughest test. No doubt, or on paper, it certainly is anyway. But a very exciting fighter, Sam Noakes, isn't he? Straight away on that front foot, taking the contest to Mendy. And like we've said, Fletch, he's seen it all before. Sam Noakes is 26, Ivan Mendy 38. The 57th fight for the Frenchman, the 14th for Sam Noakes, who stopped everybody that he's been in with. Six defeats for Mendy. But there aren't many who's had him out of there. If he can get the stoppage tonight, that's going to be seen as very significant. Two good shots there, just forced the Frenchman back. Lovely lead left up a good there from Noakes. But yeah, just a, a sign from Mendy, who's prepared to work on the inside also. So Noakes has got to keep the hands nice and high and get their hands back into the on-guard position after he's landed those hooks, because Mendy will come back with his own um, left hook especially. To say Richie as well, he can't just allow Noakes to keep tearing off on the body like that, otherwise they will eventually break him down. Yeah, but you're in against a very tough guy, and Fletch never been stopped member, but yeah, you're quite right, they do take their toll in the end. But um, it's a positive round, a positive start for Noakes. Positive start then for Sam Noakes, 11 to go. To emphasise the difference in experience, before the fight started tonight, Noakes had boxed 45 rounds compared to 392 for Mendy. Ninth time that Mendy's been in a, a scheduled 12-rounder. Yeah, this could well be a case of just, just pacing yourself right here, Fletch. Really good shots from Noakes, digging his toes into the canvas. Talk about his power, but Mendy's got 22 stoppage victories himself. So uh, he knows how to get people out of there as well. And there is a bit of history potentially on the line for Noakes tonight. Holds the British and Commonwealth titles at lightweight. He'd become the first man since Dave Charnley in the 60s to hold all of the belts if he can add the European title to it as well this evening so he's trying to do something Richie that hasn't been done for a long long time yeah tremendous that's a good shot downstairs a really solid body shot there from Noakes right at the end of the round and there's the belt there's that body shot again decent combination off the back of it as well from Noakes digs another one into the ribs of Mendy he won't enjoy that for 12 rounds, I don't care how durable he is, he's a, a really good body puncher. Yeah. With Sam Noakes, and he, he can't afford Mendy to keep allowing him to dig those powerful shots into his body like that. It's clever work from Mendy on the inside as well, the way he held um, Sam Noakes, his, his arm on the blind side of the referee, he's so experienced. Just stopped um, Noakes working there. But yeah, good work again from Noakes. He's staying relaxed, and that's the key in these situations, when you know if you've got to go 12 rounds, staying relaxed as you're punching, not tensing up, and that's what he's doing. I think it must be in his mind, and it must have been drilled into him, that he's going to have to break Mendy down. He's not just going to walk in there and blow him out. It's going to be a methodical process, and clearly they feel the body's the way to do it. Yeah. Type of contest where you've got to believe in your fitness, believe in the work that you've done in the gym. You're in against a tough opponent. Listen to your coach, keep chipping away. And he's confident in his own fitness and he'll come through it. And it's turning out to be an interesting contest. And Mendy, you can see how experienced he is, the way he takes shots on the, the gloves, sometimes on the elbows. He's, this kid is teak tough. So this is a great test for Noakes. Challenge as well, which is when they get into the second half of the fight. That's when Mendy might feel that despite the 
In fact, he's 38 years of age. He's been in long fights before. He knows how to pace himself. He might feel like if he can get past halfway and take it late, then he could potentially take over. That's a challenge down the road for Noakes tonight. Monday forced back to the ropes, and Noakes was eager to chase him in there. Good work at the end of the round. As we hear the sound of the bell. A dominant performance to this point for Sam Noakes, but he's in there with a man who's been the 12-round distance a lot. He's never been stopped, never been off his feet. He's a hard man, he's a durable fighter, and he knows how to pace himself in a situation like this. So there's a lot of work still to do for the unbeaten man from Maidstone if he's going to take the European title with him tonight. Bad body shot there from Mendy. And uh, Noakes replies. I think you can make a case, Richie, that this has been one of his better rounds to this point, Mendy. He's certainly thrown more punches thrown and had more yeah. success in this round, I hasn't he? I don't think he's won the round, but no. he's threw more shots. So we, we spoke about it earlier, didn't we? That we, we may see a sign from Mendy where he tests Noakes, and he's certainly thrown more in this round and had a bit of success. Oh, really good, good shot. shot right at the end of the round. Had him wobbling, a smile on the face of Sam Noakes. The bell's going to sound, though, and that's going to end the attack. There's a bit of blood on the face of Noakes coming from the nose. A little wink at Mendy on his way back to the corner. The first real big punch that rocked the Frenchman right at the end of the sixth. Final 30 seconds of round seven, Mendy tries to put a combination together himself. Immediately, Noakes responds with another body shot and a little short uppercut that rattled through. Yeah, but that was a good reminder there, because Mendy come back, Noakes actually missed the target. He fell in a little bit, missed the target, and Mendy came back at him. So, just a little reminder that, you know, you're in, you're in with a bit of quality here. You can't afford to make mistakes. And that will keep Noakes on, on his toes. Noakes up on his toes, bouncing around the ring, thoroughly enjoying the work, thoroughly enjoying the night, winning the fight by quite a distance. Good shot from Noakes again, and that back leg came swinging round, that's hurt him. Mendy's hurt, two minutes to go in the round. He really felt the power of Noakes there. The legs were wobbly as the punch landed, and I think Noakes senses it. Yeah, good shot there from Noakes, certainly. Give him a lot of confidence, yeah, he does sense it. Fletch and Mendy still, I don't think he's fully recovered on the ropes, which is a bad position to be in. Feet come square there. Oh, good left hook there as Mendy he turns southpaw. And he keeps targeting the body again. A minute to go in the eighth, a round that started off so well for Noakes. Mendy's head's cleared. Can't even recall too many times where Noakes has lost an exchange. He's always been the stronger fighter at the end of the exchanges between them, hasn't he? Yeah, that's always difficult to give Mendy, Mendy a round for me. He's experienced, isn't he, Mendy? He really is, the way he's still coming forward. The rounds ago, it looked like he was um, feeling a little bit, but he's, he's weathered the storm. Got a second win from somewhere, and that's the experience of this fella. And now Sam Noakes is having to just up the tempo a little bit and put him in his place, which is good. He's responded well here, Noakes. The brother Sean is screaming at ringside, George Warren on his feet as well. The crowd rising inside York Hall. It's been an outstanding display tonight from Sam Noakes. He's got a little bit more than a minute before he can add another title to his growing list. The icing on the cake would be the stoppage, but and he's going for it here. Might not be a stoppage, but the scores are going to be that wide. It's going to be so comprehensive, you'd suspect. Oh, that was a cracking right hand to the body, that was then for Noakes. Jab to the head and then switch downstairs. He wasn't expecting that. Mendy, good work again from Noakes, finishing strong. Great shot, right hand. 
That just wobbled him, that just stiffened the legs. Might just run out of time, but he's won the last round as well. A round where we thought Mendy would come out and give it everything. Sam Noakes has taken it to him, there's the final bell. He can smile, he's the European champion. We'll get the official result, but it's a no-doubter tonight. He was magnificent. All three judges score the contest, 120-108. For your winner by unanimous decision,